Right now, it's super convenient to drive around big cities like Auckland or Christchurch, so of course people don't want to give it up. But here's the thing, it is not a coincidence that it is convenient to drive. We literally built our cities for cars. We, we used to think they were the best thing since sliced bread. They went really fast and took you exactly where you wanted to go, and as far as we knew, they weren't bringing about any catastrophic weather disasters. So we built all our houses really far apart and got rid of trams and plonked in big motorways and made cars the best way to get around. It's, it's like if everyone was super into stilts when you built your house. Your front door would be 13 feet tall and all of your shelves would be super high up. Thank God for stilts, you might start saying. Otherwise, how would I open my door and reach all my shelves? Well, now imagine that we found out that stilts were the main cause of a global climate catastrophe somehow. I haven't figured out that part of the metaphor yet. So everyone had to stop using them. Yeah, you probably wish you didn't build your house like that. It's going to be pretty annoying walking around without stilts now because the door is so tall and, and you can't reach your stove without a ladder. Well, that's pretty much what happened. Right now, we're all stranded in this weird car city. And now, unfortunately, we have to stop using cars so much. We're in the process of lowering the shelves and eventually most of the doors will be human sized and it'll just make sense to take the stilts off because wearing stilts will be annoying and you'll look like an idiot.